hey guys welcome back to my channel so right now i'm actually gonna go ahead and just show you guys all the clothes that i've gotten if you haven't watched the video before this then you don't know but i am going to vegas san diego i'm gonna try to go to catalina island we're going to the beach like every weekend from july 23rd to the end of august i have something planned for leo season and you know summer bucket list type stuff so yeah let me go ahead and bring the bag up so i can show you guys another thing um so some of this clothes is from shein and some of the clothes is from tori if you guys see the red and blue eyeliner it's because i just filmed a makeup video before this and i took it off really quick but you know some eyeliner likes to stay so i'm gonna go ahead and start off with bathing suits um i ordered three new ones two of them because i loved and then the other one just in case one didn't fit so the reason why I, um i bought two pink ones is because for my friend Anissa's birthday, we're going to San Diego, we're going to be on a boat, and she wants to do a pink out, so everybody's going to wear pink, so I got, oh my god, this is going to be like a highlighter on there, but I bought these as the bottom, and I always size up like one or two sizes on Shein, so I hope this fits really good and not kind of big, I mean I doubt it, I'm a big girl, but, and this is the top, so this is the first one, then I got this pink one in case that pink one didn't fit. It's a lighter pink, like a baby pink. Those are the bottoms. And then this is the top. Like a little flowy top. And then the last one, I just thought it was super cute. And it's these bottoms and this top so cute and yes I did say I'm a big girl but just because I'm a big girl doesn't mean I can't wear two piece especially because I hate one piece because then you can't pee comfortable because you have to take it all off but yeah so let me go ahead and go try these on and I will be right back okay guys so this is the first outfit or bathing suit these are super cute they actually do come undone if you guys don't want them on this one as well super cute fits right does have um padding already in here so yeah I will also be telling you guys the sizes. I believe this one was a three. Okay, this bathing suit is actually in a 2X, but it does fit well. Little top, comes with the padding as well. Stretchy, fits really good. This one's in a two. Okay guys, so this bathing suit's actually in a three. I really like how cute the little strawberries look. Fits right, stretchy. Yeah. All right, guys. So, still in the last bathing suit because I'm actually doing the try on haul as we're talking, as I'm recording. My dogs are in here, but this is all Shein stuff, by the way. Um. So I did get this shirt, which I don't know why I'm really into like this abstract like woman thing all right guys so this is the first top that i showed you guys that i would use as like a little pool cover up so you can have it unbuttoned or you can actually button it it's up to you guys i think it's super cute let me i think this one was a 2x this one's a 2x let me go ahead and try on the next shirt and it will be right back okay guys so this is the shirt that i was scared about um i just don't like how saggy my boobs look but 
I am on the bigger side with my boobs, so maybe I'll use like a strapless bra or something, but it is super cute. Obviously, I don't want to wear a bra because of the back, but if I had to, it's pretty thick. Um, these shorts are from Torrid. I don't know the name of them, but yeah, I'll be back with the next shirt. I had to tell you guys but the other um bandana shirt was in a three this one's actually in a zero and i don't really like to show that much because i am on the bigger size like all of it comes out through the side so i'm not that comfortable with the shirt maybe if it was like a smaller size so it can be tight around my neck maybe even put like a pin here or something this is super cute. I just feel like the hole was way too big. But yeah, this one's in a zero. I'll be back with the next shirt. Okay, guys, so I forgot to check what size this is in. But I don't know if you can tell that this is the end of like the triangle your boob is supposed to be in. But I don't know if it's because my boobs are bigger and like they like to stick out from the side. But I just felt more comfortable putting the whole triangle. On my boob also because of this circle thing if I were to have my boob like this this circle thing is like this because my boobs are too big so I do like this shirt it's just I don't know if I'd ever actually wear it this is the back it's also probably a lot easier to get on if you have somebody there to help you tie it but yeah when I try on the black shirt, I'll go ahead and let you guys know what size this one's in. Okay guys, so this shirt, one piece, is in a 1X. The leopard cheetah print shirt was in a 3. Um, the good thing about this strap is that it's adjustable. It is sheer, so you do need like some type of pasties, but for me, I personally will be doing a strapless bra because I will be, you know, it'll be covered. Um, I also forgot to mention that the straps on the bathing suit are also adjustable. Alright you guys, so I forgot to, I was just like changing into the next thing, but I have three dresses from Shein. So the one I'm wearing, which you guys will see in the try on, and this is supposed to be like a dark green, which it is in person, but like when light reflects on it, honestly, I feel like it looks a little blue, like, I don't know, but it's supposed to be like really dark green, and it's like this, like it crosses on your boob. I have this pink glittery one. Excuse my armpits if you see them because I haven't shaved, but let me go ahead and show you guys this first dress. I haven't tightened the straps. This one's about to come undone. I hope it doesn't, that'd be embarrassing. But um, I would tighten the straps, me personally, and put a faja on. I'm, I'm literally just wearing like regular underwear right now, so if you see my little fupa, my little pouch, that's why. So, see how my underwear line, like you can definitely see it because it stops right here. But this is the dress. Doesn't do anything for the butt. But I think it is super cute. Again, I would personally tighten this so that this looks a little lower and better. And wear a faja just so that this pooch isn't here. And also this line wouldn't be here because I would put like, you know, whatever. This one, I think I got in a two. Um, I will tell you guys once I tried this one on. Okay guys, so it does fit a little weird here, which I saw a lot in the comments. So maybe I'll have my dad fix that for me. But this is super cute. Has a slit, ruched, so you don't really see the pouch that much, but you can still see it. So this one is actually in a four because it doesn't stretch. Like, it stretches on me because I would have gotten it in a three, but all the comments said that it was like super super tight um which I feel like I like the loose effect because then can't really see the pooch 
Um, the blue one I had on before is actually in a three, and this one's in a four. Okay, let me go ahead and try on that pink one, and I will be right back. The straps are adjustable on this one, by the way. Alright, you guys, so this one is sheer. I am wearing black underwear, so it is sheer, but this one's in a size three. I would have kept it at a size two because this is a little loose. I tucked it in a little bit right here just so that, you know, um, but again, I wish it was tighter here. So I would recommend you keep your size because I would have gone with the two originally, but I read the comments. But a lot of the reviews on everything is like size up, size up, size up. So I sized up like one, two, three sizes. But I mean, super cute dress. Might wear it for like my birthday or something. Again, definitely would put a faja on. She has a little bit of boob, but not that much. Which I like. I like that this is big enough to cover my whole boob. So I don't know if it would be that big if. I kept it at a two, but this is it for the Shein part. Now let me show you guys everything I got from Torrid, and I'll do that try on haul. Okay guys, so I lied. I got accessories, so. By the way, I'm still waiting for, so they split my package into two, and I only got one half. The other half has like some anklets, bracelets, and two dresses, so. I will show you guys when they get here but I bought two pairs of sunglasses and I've never been a big sunglasses person just because I don't know the shape of my head so I don't know what shape to get like I don't know but I just thought these were cute so oh my god my ear so I got these which I don't think they look bad. Watch me be editing this <laughs> like, girl, <laughs> take those off. Um, you guys can see all the lights in the back. Let me see if I turn it on. Too dark, but super cute. I like them. I like the square. I feel like even if I were to wear them, like, you know? Um, yeah, so this is the first pair. They do come in like this nice case and inside of the case comes a little thing in case you guys want to wipe them. Put them back in here. Now the second pair again comes in the case with the little cloth. Can't, they do come in a baggie but I had opened those already so comes with a baggie and then comes with little things over the leaves that I already took off. These are like the smaller frame that people tend to wear like off their nose. I think they're cute. I feel like, never mind. I don't want to say that because I don't want to get canceled, but I think they're cute. I like them. So she gets, sorry, a 10 out of 10 for sunglasses. They have really cute sunglasses and they're only like $3, $5 I think. No, I think the sunglasses were $3 and the purses were $5. Now let me tell you, I know why they're only $3. So I got these two. So here's the first one. Look how flat and like flimsy it is so you push this and it opens like this so like you know what this feels like you guys know those folders that you get for school that like what do they call like accordion folders or whatever and you can open it and it has like things in here that's what this outside thing feels like but i mean it was just for a quick trip and pictures so i was like let me just do it so this is like a little gucci inspired moment And then this is a little Louis Vuitton moment. Again, flat, flimsy, feels like plastic. But to open it, this one you turn, lift, and open. So, you know, I'm just gonna have 
my wallet and my phone in here. So I thought they were a perfect size. Um, okay, so now for sure that's it for Shein. Now for Torrid. Again, two orders. Um, the other order I believe has another two or three shirts and two jeans. This has two jeans, which jeans are so hard to shop for me. Like from Hollister, um, I started off at a 13, then a 14, then a 16, and then an 18, and then they got tight. And so like toward I can do 16 and 18, like it doesn't, they both fit. It's just 18, obviously there's more room. I bought four pairs of jeans and an 18. But there's this color, like this dark color. These are in the jegging super soft style. I will be trying those on. And then I got them some, I got some black ones in premium bombshell skinny. And they have ribs. So I will be trying both of those on. For shirts, I love friends. Because I'd rather be watching friends. And a one. So for Torrid, if I want it baggy, I'll get a one. If I like it fitted, it'll be a zero. This shirt's actually in a zero. So these two shirts are in a one as well. So I just got this plain orange one and this tie-dye one that says Los Angeles. And this shirt's in a zero. Cute little flower moment. It has like this ruched at the top, like where your boobs are. Um, yeah, so let me try those on. I will be right back. And I will do another try on haul when I get the other Shein package and the other toy package. So. I'll be right back. Okay, you guys. So this is the shirt. Like I said, I got it in a one. So it is baggy. Okay, the jeans. These are the jegging jeans. They fit good. And I got them regular. So they fit my foot all the way down. Does it make the butt look good? I'm going to go ahead and try on the next shirt with these jeans. And then when I try on the black jeans, I'll try on a different shirt. But, yeah. Okay, you guys. So, this is the size zero shirt. I think it's super cute for, you know, a party or something. I am wearing a bra under, so I can't, like, it'll look weird because it doesn't go all the way down. But you can do a strapless bra with this shirt. Super cute, fits really good. Yeah, now let me put on the black jeans with the two other shirts. Okay guys, so this is the shirt with the black jeans. Fits so good. The butt. And they have rips, both sides, again, the regular go all the way down. The cuts go all the way to the knees. There's no cuts in the butt or anything. One more shirt. All right, you guys, so this is just the plain orange shirt I showed you guys. Super cute. Torrid shirts are usually really long on me. So I usually just pick it up in the butt area and let it hang in the front. Super cute. One last thing, you guys. If you guys like the shorts that I'm wearing in this try-on haul, they're also a size 18. Um, probably could have done a 16 because they're a little loose. But it's all buttons, no zipper. Five buttons. And I try to look for the style, and all it says is feel the fit. So... I want to say that's the style of name, but oh my god, I need to go get my hair redone. Look how much it's grown out. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this try on haul. Um, I will be posting another one soon. If 
you guys have any video recommendations go ahead and comment them down below thank you guys so much for watching i'm sorry that it's taking me this long to post videos it's just been crazy you know but i love you guys thank you guys see you guys next time